Again, it's great to see you. I'm just out having a drive in the Makermobile. Where do you think we should go today? Whoa! Tucky here. Mimi, make a message. Hello, I'm Natalia. Hello, Natalia. Can I help you today? Yes, please, Mr. Maker. I'll be there very soon. <laughs> I've arrived! <laughs> Hello, Natalia. Lovely to meet you. Now, how can I help you today? Can we make a picture with shapes in it? A picture with shapes in it? That's a great idea. Oh, I love shapes. I am a shape. <laughs> well, I can't get that song out of my head. I know. Why don't we make a picture with colourful circles in it? I've just had a great idea. Let's try something. Try making a sponge circle print picture. It's very colourful and great fun to do. Let's make it! But first, we'll need somewhere to make it. <laughs> and we'll also need some things from the doodle drawer. <laughs> A large sheet of paper or card. Some paper cups and some scissors. Hmm, we also need something else. I wonder if scraps can help. Oh, hello, scraps. Now we need some sponge kitchen cloths. Can you help, please? Oh, scraps, what are you doing down there? Oh, well done, Scraps. Thank you. <laughs> Brilliant. Brightly coloured paint. In fact, lots of brightly coloured paint. Ooh. And some paper plates and a pen. OK, then, Natalia, let's make a sponge circle print picture like this one here with lots of colourful circles. Are you ready? Yeah. Brilliant. Are you ready? Fantastic. Let's get making. Now, the first thing we're going to do is make some big and small sponge circles from our sponge kitchen cloths. Now, we can do this by drawing around the top and bottom of a paper cup like this. A big circle. And a small circle. Now, you can make as many circles as you like. Now, it's time to cut out our circles. But we need to be careful with scissors because they are... Sharp. That's right. Our circles are ready, and now we're going to squeeze some blobs of coloured paint onto some paper plates. And you can use whatever colours you like. Now we can bring in our background card, like this, and we're going to start printing with the big sponge circles. Dip them into the paint and print them onto the card. Look at that! Now we can carry on doing this with all the other colours until we've filled up our card. But remember to use a different sponge circle for each colour of paint. 
Now, Natalia, which colour should we use next? Green. Green, good idea. There, our big circle prints are all dry. Now we're going to use the small sponge circles and we're going to print them on top of our big circle prints. Make sure that your small circle print is a different colour to your big circle print. When everything's dry, you've made a fantastic sponge circle print picture. And if you like shapes like Natalia, perhaps you could choose different ones for your picture, like rectangles, triangles or... Squares. That's right. Now, this has been great fun, Natalia, but I think we can have even more fun, don't you? Yes. Let's make a big painting together. And this is going to get a little bit messy, so it's a really good idea to put on some old clothes or an apron. Oh, we look great! And we'll also need a really big piece of paper, lots of paint, and some really big sponge circles. Let's get circle printing. Come on, Natalia, this way. Well done. Thank you. There! we finished! Did you enjoy that? Yeah. We made it! And now your home is where the art is. High five! Hey! <laughs> what a fun picture! Well done, Natalia. Bye! <sighs> <laughs> it's brilliant being out and about in the Maker Mobile. There's always so much to see and do. <laughs> uh, what's that noise? <laughs> Oh, who could it be? I am a shape. I am a shape. I am a circle. I am a triangle. What's hiding in the rectangles? Any ideas yet? It's a dog! <laughs> well done, shapes. It's time to get back in the doodle drawers. Oh, it's such a brilliant day for a lovely drive out in the Makermobile. <laughs> yeah. Minute Make Time! Hey, it's Minute Make Time! I'm on my way! <laughs> Here we are. It's Minute Make Time, everyone! Yay! Now, I've been invited to a fancy dress party, but who should I go as? Hmm. Oh, I know. Perhaps I should get dressed up like a princess. <coughs> oh! <laughs> Maybe not. I could dress up as a pop star. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but... I think I might go to the party in disguise and wear... <laughs> These silly sunglasses. They're very silly, aren't they? 
and we can make them in just one minute. Now here's what we'll need. Some pieces of fun fur, some old sunglasses or toy glasses, a glue stick and an old empty egg carton. Now, do you think it's possible to make these silly sunglasses in just one minute? No way! Well, let's find out. I'm going to have to be very quick, but don't worry. I'll remind you how to do it at the end. Are you ready? Yes! <laughs> Are you ready? Brilliant! Let's make it in a minute. Right, let's get our egg carton and then we're going to very carefully tear out this pointed section here in the middle. There we go. And we also need to make this into a nose. Hang on, let's put some glue on this part here. And then stick on this piece of fun fur to make an orange moustache. There we go, that's going to look really good. <laughs> right, let's put that over there and now we're going to get our sunglasses and put some glue all the way along the top there and there. And then we can stick on some funny eyebrows. There's one. <laughs> and there's another one. Let's put a bit in there. And then we can stick in the nose as well into there. <laughs> and we've made some silly sunglasses. <laughs> Just in time. And if you've got more than a minute, you can paint the nose and make all kinds of silly sunglasses. Oh! <laughs> I like this one with yellow eyebrows, a green nose and a bushy blue moustache. <laughs> or well, you could try this one with pink and orange feathers and a glittery mouth. Oh! <laughs> and you can even make silly sunglasses with a big piece of fun fur for a big bushy beard. <laughs> Silly sunglasses made in a minute. Why don't you try it? Here's a reminder of how to do it. Let's go back to the beginning and take another look. Tear a point out of an egg box and stick some fun fur onto it. Glue along the top of the glasses and stick on more fun fur for the eyebrows. Stick the nose onto the glasses and your silly sunglasses are finished. Why don't you try and make it in a minute? Well, it's time for me to go, everyone. Thanks for being part of another marvellous Minute Make. Goodbye! Yeah! <laughs> Where shall we go next? Hello, Mr Maker. Oh, nice to see you. What do you think we're making today? Oh, I'm not sure. Let's take a look. I am Pete. I am brown. I am pink. I am black. I am grey. I am green. Done, everybody. See you soon. Shh. It's time for a big surprise. <laughs> I've got a treat for these mini makers. <laughs> Shall we give them a big surprise? Hello. <laughs> <laughs> Hello, my friends. It's great to meet you. And today we're going to make something that's out oh, of this world. Now, have you ever seen an alien from outer space? No. no. Well, don't worry if you haven't, because today we're going to make a big alien planet with aliens and spaceships and stars. All right, then. Macaulay, Michael, Millie, Olivia and Jeremy, let's make it. All right, then, Mini Makers, we're going to make a big alien planet. So let's start off with our alien. What should it look like, do you think? 1,000 eyeballs. 1,000 eyes on our alien. What about this here? Could we make this into an alien? Yeah. And could we put some eyes on this, do you think? Yeah, I can see your face. These little ones can be the eyes. 
Oh, that would be good. Now, what about a really big spaceship? What would it look like? What would it look like? Jeremy, what's that? Kitchen foil. Kitchen foil. That would be great. We can wrap this around our spaceship and make it all shiny. What about the planets? What can we make the planets from? What's down there? Oh, the beach ball. Pass it over. Thank you, Macaulay. Here we go. Thank you very much. This would make a great planet, wouldn't it? Yeah! Let's make it. <laughs> These are going to be the planets. And these are the stars. Now, our alien needs to have amazing eyes. So what should they look like? <laughs> there we go, perfect. This is a shiny spaceship and a cardboard crater. Don't forget the space background. Now, you are all stars. So stick them in the sky, go on. That's it. <laughs> this big surprise has been great fun so far, so why don't you join in and make your very own mini-make? Try making your own shiny spaceship with an alien on board. Make it, play with it, have fun with it. To make one, you will need paper plates, some glue, plastic bowls, modelling clay and stickers, a clear pot and a pipe cleaner, plastic lids, a googly eye, kitchen foil, a pencil and scissors, and some sticky tape. First, stick two paper plates together with sticky tape like this. Then take two plastic bowls and glue the paper plates in between them. Cover the spaceship with gloopy glue and pieces of kitchen foil. Add stickers and bottle tops for lights. To make the alien, roll up a ball of modelling clay, give it a squeeze and stick on a googly eye. Now carefully cut a pipe cleaner in half. Bend the pieces into wiggly arms, push them into the alien and use a pencil to make a mouth. Cover the top of the spaceship with glue. Stick on the alien and a clear pot like this. And your super spaceship is ready to play with. What a fantastic flying saucer. But I wonder how our big alien planet's coming along. Come on, come on. <laughs> That's it. <laughs> Where do you want it? Lower. Lower, are you sure? Lower. Stop, okay. Stop, 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 stop. There, there. Here we go. Well done, everyone. We made it! Yeah! What fun! And look at those friendly aliens! Oh! Mr Maker, time to go! Well, that's it for now. My making time's over, but yours is just beginning. It's time to put the Makermobile back in its box. <laughs> If you like making things, visit bbc.co.uk slash cbbs. Make it, Mr. Baker. La, 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 Mr. Baker.